hello everyone analytics sage uh, one of the other charts that i like is bngo so for a couple of reason i like this chart uh, i will explain here so this looks like a wave one wave two wave three and possible wave four and then we should go for a wave five now if you look at the invalidation criteria because we should not touch the top of the wave one you can see we kind of just missed it with couple of pips if i zoom in or if i go let's go to the one hour chart so you can see things better just at the invalidation level so in my opinion it is still a valid impulse the wave two here is not deep this is not a dip and this is complex so you are expecting a deep wave four and simple in a term simple so if we have a look at the wave four, it looks like a very classic zigzag pattern first wave triangle one two three abc four again you see the rule of alteration here which is so important and the wave five the criteria for uptrend in a zigzag pattern is usually this level must get broken but if you want to be early wave four of the previous degree which, which just got broke so this is one good thing wave four of the previous degree the main trend channel of the correction got broke this is also the second good thing now let's have a look at how it is being unfolded is it corrective or impulsive also i'm seeing the rise in the volume this is also good so we have all the criteria now what i'm having at this wave count this looks like a kind of a complete impulse in my opinion now we have one wave two wave in a smaller degree and one wave in bigger degree to unfold so this is possibly a three of three which should be the sharpest one then we need a wave four correspond to this wave and then we need a wave five and then we need another wave four correspond to this wave and then up and that would be the wave three correspond to this wave so if it wants to unfold uh, impulsive this is a very possible scenario but as i always mention it's super hard to predict how these strong uptrend markets are gonna unfold if it's going to be impulsive because it can unfold and we can see more and more waves so this is the minimum i'm expecting so to trade this i'm expecting the market to get back retest the wave four of the previous degree which corresponds to the trend channel and from here market should go up this wave four here should correspond to this one so maybe we see some more of a little bit more complex correction and the market should go up keep an eye on this one i'm seeing most of the criteria that we need uh, for this to start a move also you can see moving averages 250 are heading up the market is closed above these moving averages let me show you the rsi let me show you the okay to be the wave four if this is a wave one this is a wave three this is wave three and if this is a wave four yes at the resistant level for an uptrend we saw this resistance so i'm expecting this market to go up usually when the wave four is too deep okay you can expect a wave five truncated truncated this could be a possibility so we might get to top of here and if the market doesn't break then the whole structure will be destroyed but we have got a long way because this is a two-week chart and it's too early to judge what's gonna happen in a bigger degree this might go up to create a wave one then we will see a wave two three four and then five thanks for watching and have a good night